Good day, YouTubers, and welcome to the vlog. For today is a good day. I thought I was going to be doing editing for something else all day long, and uh, but that's not happening. So uh, my day has opened up immensely, and I didn't have any video really for tonight uh, because we have three people who sponsor tonight. It is Curry, Kyle, and Wendy. They all sponsor today's video. So it is 10 o'clock in the morning. I'm gonna have to book it up to Barry, find something uh, to review uh, just for you, and uh, or just for you three mainly. Well, you guys donated to the food bank, so. Uh, and I wanna do some birthday wishes first. I, obviously I have to shave. I like, I think I cut myself shaving and then I got a little scab there and then I picked it last night and it bled. Okay, enough of my bleeding stories. Okay, so uh, happy birthdays. We have Joey's birthday, Jake, Nick, Kelly, and Julianne, Jules as we call her. Uh, happy birthday to everybody, that is awesome. Uh, I just wanna go to, I just wanna click on my Facebook, go to Facebook, cause sometimes it tells me how old everybody is. <laughs> the evil laugh of you're getting older. Okay, where is it, events? Come on, and it says there, and for others, see all. Okay, oh, it's not telling me. Aww. Oh, there? yes it is, okay. So Nick is turning 24, Jake is turning 22, Joey's turning 19, 18, Julianne is 43, and Kelly doesn't want anybody to know how old she is. So she's 29. Because uh, that's how old you stop at when you're getting older. You're just 29, that's it. I'm not getting older than 29. All right, so uh, like I said, my day's opened up really big. This is awesome news. So I'm gonna go up to do the food review number one. Number two, I'm gonna go to Mac, which is Mountain Equipment Co-op, and just possibly talk myself into buying that computer. Uh, and then Henry's, uh, I'm gonna buy one of the lights. Um, a person I know bought some lights to do some reviews and uh, or interviews, and uh, they're really small. They're about 149 bucks. I'll show you them when I get there, and uh, hopefully I get um, preferred customer rates on that. That will be nice. So I'll be doing all that today. So it is an all-day vlog just for you. Let's go. Shave first, shower, and then we'll be out of here. But you don't have to see that. And we're back. I'm just gonna book it into Bradford, shoot the video, get back here, start uh, compressing it, try to get it as built as much as possible because it turns out I have to take Ben up to an orthodontist appointment uh, and that's up in Barry. And I don't wanna go all the way up to Barry, do my food review, try to get to Mac Henry's. Uh, I need fish tank lights. Uh, I don't want to do all that. It was, it was a waste of time to come back here and then go down to Bradford, pick up Ben, and then go back up to, Br to Barry for his orthodontist appointment. La, 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 la. And uh, so I'm going to zip down to Bradford because it's closer, do a food review at a place that you guys probably never heard of, uh, get back here, like I said, get all that stuff done. So before we do that, might as well get a little crazy. <laughs> go to the fridge. Oh, oh, and I can't remember. Uh, we have lime an orange left of Dame's power drinks. And uh, Pamela, she sent me a heads up email. All right, we're back. Pamela wrote, uh, orange was 57 to lime 30. Seven. So it looks like we're doing orange. And like I said, I put them in the fridge to see if they, if it changes the molecular structures. Don't know why I went with that accent. So let's get down to the business here. So there is a, an actual pull off tab. You tear it off in a downward fashion if it works, but I just like to rip it off. Cause I'm crazy that way. So here we go, Dame. I'm actually thinking this might be my, oh, I just brushed my teeth. This is gonna taste definitely different than what it's probably supposed to taste like. What we could do, just do a little bit of water. Swish out the mouth. Clean shaven, look at that. Okay, here we go. This is Dame's orange 
energy drink. Here we go. Smells like orange. <coughs> That's me choking on something else. Just a second. Mm -hmm. Orange wins. Orange the, at this point in time. And until I do the lime, uh, I think orange would be my favorite out of the four that I've done so far. Hmm. It'd be interesting to know if the toothpaste had any... <coughs> Again, that's not Dame's <coughs> thing. As I was speaking to you, I inhaled saliva. Because I'm, a, because I'm an animal. Right, Louis? He was yelling at me. Oh, Sam. No barking. Here we go. Yummy. Yes, that is my Jim Carrey impression. When you watch Jim Carrey movies, like over and over and over again, it sticks in your brain forever and ever. Oh, Amen. Oh, Sam, stop it. Monkey 2 is hanging outside and Sam's all freaking out. Oops. So there you go. We're almost, we got one more to go and then we're all done. Cool. All right, so I'm gonna book it down to Bradford, get the food review shot and get back here as fast as possible with no pressure and no energy drinks in my stomach to make me talk faster. Just about to take Sam for his walk and Monkey 2 is coming to say hello. Hey Monkey 2, you wanna say hi? Oh, don't touch the camera, don't touch the camera. Oh, somebody's home, let you in. Go check. See all the ice on our roof? Hopefully it gets a little bit warmer. Oh my gosh, he's on my leg. Oh, ow, ow, ow. Ow! <laughs> it's like sharpening his claws on my pant leg. Not good. Okay, he's coming with us. It's been a while since you guys have come for a walk the dog vlog. Let's do it. I thought I'd take you down to the lake and show you the the, the ice. It gets, uh, I guess, compressed and starts to drive itself up. And uh, it's kind of neat to see. I'm not sure if they're gone down or not. Chances are they're still there. I also wanted to give uh, you guys a heads up. Uh, I, didn't, I don't usually talk about money and stuff, but in this situation, I just wanted to, some people, you know, get a little upset when I seem to be lazy and just do like a quick short vlog. But no matter how much effort I put into my vlogs, this channel only makes about $88 a month. And I do this every day, almost. There are a few days I miss, just because I didn't think anything was really worth sharing on that day and I didn't want to waste your time. So, again, just to give you guys a heads up, this channel doesn't make any money at all. It's all about me talking with you guys. Uh, possibly over the next year, this channel might get bigger. Uh, and then I could possibly, you know, hire someone to help edit and stuff like that so I can not waste time. Uh, so, and I've noticed pretty much within 24 hours of me launching a vlog, it gets at least 1500 views. 500 to 1500 views and uh, it's only getting around 100 likes maybe so I'd love to see some support it doesn't cost you any money whatsoever it's just a click of your mouse right at the beginning of watching one of my vlogs just in case you don't want to watch the whole thing just click the like button you won't believe how much that helps my channel out. Like I said, at this point in time, I'm making 88 bucks a month on this channel. So I am not doing this channel for money. Eventually, I'd love for this channel to be making money, but at this point in time, it is making jump change. But I love talking to you guys. I love listening to your feedback. Your, your, uh, your comments are usually, not usually, your comments are always awesome. So, and again, there are people that just come here for the very first time and they see like a short vlog and they're like, this sucks. But I don't pay attention to that. Come on, Sam, we're gonna show them the lake. Come on. So here we are on Lake Simcoe. This is gonna be a long vlog, I bet. 
So here are the, forget the pressure cracks, that's what they call them. So we'll get close to a pressure crack. It's snowed on top of the pressure cracks, so they're not as brilliant looking. My fingers are starting to freeze. It was, it's, it's quite mild today compared to other days. So uh, I can't even see my camera anymore. It better be on. Yes, it's recording, okay. So here's the pressure cracks. Just to show you how thick this ice is. Look at that. My hand span is nine inches. It's always good to measure your hand span because then when you're out and you don't have like a measuring tool of some type, you can just put your hand up to something and get a really good rough idea of how big something is. So my hand span is nine inches. So that ice is like nine, 10, 11, 12 inches thick. And that's just the stuff that's near the shallows that got pushed up. It looks quite cool when lots of it gets pushed up like that. Here are the ice huts that you can rent. This would be a company's spot where he dumps them until somebody comes to rent them. They put locks on them so people don't screw around with them. So they usually have like a bit of a heater in it. So there's, here's one open one. This is obviously the, the barbecue one. So they have their propane, their barbecue, and this would be parked in amongst a bunch of huts. So the, the owner of these huts would put them out and uh, put them all in the same area and uh, put that barbecue and everybody could use the barbecue. So they're on these wooden skids. And they hook it up to their snowmobile or their uh, quad bike, whatever you want to call it, and ATV. So this is for this is the heater unit. That's the gas for the heater. Like I said, it's on skids. And then they just hook that up and he drags them out. Uh, I don't think they can daisy chain them. I think they just pull one at a time. And uh, then he'll put them in a spot that he knows where the fish are and uh, people just rent them. He takes them out there or they go out by themselves. I'm not sure how that works, but uh, I'm sure if you rent, he would take you out. So there you go, guys, a little, oh, there you go. A little shout out to Orange Mobile Huts. And there's the phone number if you're ever interested in coming to Ontario to go fishing. A little shout out to the locals. All right, we gotta get to Bradford, do a food review. Let's go. All right, people, we are headed down to Bradford and we will grab some food. And I can't remember the name of the restaurant off the top of my head. I think it is called San Francisco, which is kind of tying into the fact that I'm going to San Francisco in, in a month and a bit, uh, or two months and a bit. End of it. All right, let's go. As you can see by the bag on my chair there, uh, we have finished up at Wimpy's. Uh, this video will go up tomorrow. Uh, I'm not sure if I actually did vlog about where I changed my mind. Uh, as I was passing by Wimpy's, I'm like, I haven't done anything for Wimpy's yet. So I turned around and went back to Wimpy's instead of going to the, um, excuse me, that's how good it was. Uh, the San Francisco place. So I'll probably do that another time just because as I was going there and as I passed by Wimpy's, uh, the thing that I was gonna do at San Francisco place was basically a veal on a, on a bun because uh, it's one of my favorite things at like Greasy Spoon restaurant type places. And uh, so, and I kind of did a wiener schnitzel, which is kind of almost the same thing. So I thought it maybe be too close together. So I changed my mind at the last second because I can do that because I own this, you know, domain, this channel. I can do anything I want. Anyway, so we are heading back home. I'm going to start to download it, compress it and everything. It's going to go up tomorrow night. I'm just going to probably work hard at putting this vlog together for you guys tonight. It's going to be a long one. Uh, so we'll do some stuff at home. Then I got to zip back down, grab Ben, go back up to Brad, Barry. Brad for a pickup Ben, Barry to go for his orthodontist. Then I'll take him shopping with me. We'll get some of the things done. We'll take you guys with us. How's that? It's time to sing a few songs. There's a rat in the kitchen, what am I gonna do? There's a rat in the kitchen, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna fix that rat, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna fix that rat. Boys in bikinis, girls in surfboards, everybody's rocking. Watch out for the piranha. There go the Norwal. Trunk. Pop the 
trunk. Good God! Pop the trunk! Enough of that singing. Okay, I'm here at the post office. And I've got one of these things. That means you've got a parcel. It's too big for the postman. Postal delivery service person. Uh, to put in that car and put in your mailbox. So here we are. Let's go get it. All right. Here you are. Thank you very much. No problem. Take care. You too. So it looks like it is a parcel from Jeffrey Oliver. He has an awesome channel. I'll put the link in the description below to his. That's funny because he has my my real address. Certain people actually know exactly where I live. And uh, so it didn't go to my P.O. box. So I can't show you the box. And it says processed food. Nice. All right, thanks Jeff. So let's go home and open up the box. All right guys, we're obviously home now and I opened up the box and it is from Jeff from Gojo Media. Uh, he says, hi Ken Hope, this package gets to you okay. I have put some very popular Australian snack food in it. Uh, stuff customs would like to keep for themselves. And it doesn't look like it's been too disturbed, which is good. Anyway, you and the family should like most in not all of this. Uh, thanks for the years of association on YouTube. It's been great and real privilege to get to know you. Jeff, and look at his little picture, he's so cute. All right, so let's get into this real quick. Just open it up, check out what we've got. These are popular treats. Cheese L's. So look like uh, cheesy rings. Mmm. And just to give you a heads up, I'm doing this one next. This is from Norwegian. Nor Norway, right? That's what we said. Yeah, Norwegian treats. So, uh... So we're going to be doing that one next, so don't panic. Uh, Lolly Gobel Blizz Bombs Nutty Caramel Popcorn. Ooh, I think I'm going to like that one. And this one is Twisties Cheese. Life's pretty straight without Twisties. All right. Uh oh, what's over here? Oh, and shapes. Nacho cheese flavor. Those look like they're gonna be yummy. I need some snacks while I watch a movie or something. So we'll do those right after we do the Norwegian box because uh, that was the last bundle of food. Uh, that was a fan package sent to me to try out and he's been uh, been waiting a long time for that. Okay, so we'll get that one done and then we'll do this one and then we might do jelly beans and they're Tabasco flavored. Chocolate covered jelly beans, Tabasco flavored. Yummy, and we also have another alien fresh jerky. Spicy, sweet and spicy. Ooh. All right, so uh, I'm gonna go pick up Ben. Talk to you later, bye. We picked up Ben, we're heading up to Barry. Ben, say hi. Hello. Uh, so we're taking him up to the orthodontist. I never can say that word properly. And I would say the ortho appointment. So he had his braces off in the summertime, I believe. Or has, no, it, it, has it been like a year now? Wasn't it Christmas? Christmas like last no. year? Yeah, it's like over a year. Yeah, I had them off for you. I remember saying this was like one of the better Christmas presents. Ah, uh, getting your braces off. I got my braces off. So uh, he's just going in for a checkup, so they just want to make sure things aren't moving into the wrong spots. Because teeth just tend to move all by themselves uh, after you get your braces off. So we're just going to do that, and then we might head on over to Henry's, and then over to Mountain Equipment Co-op, and the fish tank place. Hang on. Ben and I were just discussing. By the way, we're here. Uh, you know, the, the lottery is like $17 million right now. So we, we, I just asked Ben out of curiosity, what would you buy for $17 million? He said he'd spend it all on CSGO. <laughs> if, if you know what CSGO is, it's just a, a gaming. Just, yes, it is. We are walkers. We don't take the elevator. 
Elevators are for unhealthy people. <laughs> and people that need elevators, but if you don't need an elevator, don't use it. That's what I'm saying. Anyway, I said I'd buy a million dollar home and a Lamborghini, but uh, I couldn't figure out what color it is. And Ben's like, yeah, first world problems. First, first world That's millionaire rich, problems. Rich people problems. Rich people problems. Which color can my car be? All right, we're all finished up at the ortho, orthodontist. And uh, the white balance is gonna go whack oh, now. Heck? Oh, that's a crazy heavy door, man. Oh, look at that white balance, nice. Anyway, so uh, our next appointment is in March and I made an appointment for me. Go on. Get those teeth. See how much it cost to, to straighten those suckers up. I had braces when I was uh, Ben's age, and I neglected to wear my retainers, and then my wisdom teeth came in and destroyed everything. So, if you have braces, follow the rules, and then your teeth won't go crooked and waste everybody's money. All right, so we just finished up at Henry's, and I got myself uh, light. It's called uh, Kudos and it's a very small light. It's meant for GoPros. And uh, so I've been meaning to put it like right here because uh, I find that sometimes it's too dark in here and uh, it definitely affects the quality of video for you guys. So splurge a little bit on that one. I wanted to buy two, but I want to buy, I'm just going to buy one for now. See how well it works. And if it works and I'll buy another one, I'll put it on this side. Uh, over here and that will give me light from there, light from here, and it'll look amazing. All right, where we go off to next, Ben? Mech. We are now at Mech, Mountain Equipment Co-op. And this is the bike section. And these are the computers. And I want the 510 right there. 510, I don't need the bundle, which is 480. I just need the... I put it in this anti-theft box, but I can get through that. Just kidding. Don't be afraid. Don't be disgusting. Okay, let's buy it. So I got my two uh, new lights at the aquarium shop just across the street. Now we're at uh, Canada Computers. Ben, I think, it wants to get a new keyboard or something. We'll see. Now the problem with being in a store like this is you see really cool things like this. Look at this joystick, man. It's like everything. And it's even got like, you know, what would that be? Throttle up, throttle down for like jumbo jet type stuff, man. Left, right, engine. That's crazy stuff. Two engine there. Look at this thing. It's crazy. And this chair, guys. This chair is rocking, man. I want this chair so bad. Look at this. It's a gaming chair. The D, the DXR Racer, I guess, or DX Racer. The way they have their logo, it messes me up. Look at this gaming stuff. I want it all. Oh yeah, that's what I need, so I can edit videos faster. <laughs> Look at this computer, you can see through it. Very cool store to be in. It's kind of dangerous. I think I'm gonna lose some money today but gain some cool stuff. All right, guys, that's all I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed this 25 minute vlog of almost pretty much everything I did today. So we'll talk to you tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow might be a shorter vlog, but at least you get a video uh, for my big channel, which will be the Wimpy's food. All right, thanks for watching. Don't forget to thumbs up. Ding, 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 ding. Talk to you later, bye.